What's up, what's up, what's up? Welcome back. About to show you this Cousins Main Lobster. It's a kit you can get. Um, the food truck pull up everywhere. Normally they're based out of Florida, but you can book them to go anywhere you want them to go. This kit costs $110. Supposedly you can make six lobster rolls out of it. They also have a $190 kit that you can make uh, 12 lobster rolls out of it. So anyway, show you what they got. They give you the main lobster meat. And you get two of those, so I guess you can get three out of each one. So I'm going to show you how to make three of them real quick, and we're going to go from there. So there's your lobster meat. They give you some butter. They give you little condiments or whatnot. You get your rolls, you get six of those, but well, they say eight rolls, so maybe you're supposed to make eight lobster rolls. I don't know. Is there really eight in there? Maybe I can't count. One, two, three, four, five, six. It says six lobster rolls, but the pack says eight, so I guess they take two of them out of it. And they give you some lemons, because you put a little bit of lemons on your um, lobster rolls while you're cooking them. But anyway, we're using this cast iron today. This is that member's mark. We're going to pour a little bit of butter into the pan. Oh, first off, let me make sure I got the proper utensils to be in here cooking. All right, we're going to cook with this. That other cast iron over there will be for the butter. So we're going to actually keep that on about two. I mean, that's what we're going to put the rolls like. You're supposed to cook them off lightly and a little bit of butter, so they say. So it is what it is. We're going to see how that works out. We're gonna turn this down a little bit. The cast iron's already been on. You know, cast iron don't play no games. Sometimes it can get a little hot. Now, while you're at the food truck, they actually give you the butter in a liquid form. Of course, you know it solidifies by the time you come back get to the house we got our butter right there you ain't supposed to do no special seasoning you know what I'm saying that's on you if you want to throw all kind of seasoning your food but I suggest you don't so you can get the full experience but anyway this is actually the main lobster uh, they got the Connecticut one as well we're gonna use the main one today we didn't get the Connecticut kit we're going to move that grease around the pan, I mean that butter. You just want to cook this till it's warm. Of course it's already cooked, you can tell. Oh, that looks pretty. Pretty, pretty, pretty. You don't want to need nothing in there. Like I said, it costs you $110. You want to get every little piece that you can. Now what you do, you set that to the side, grab you a lemon, so you're going to squeeze you a lemon while you're cooking it as well. Sure smells like lobster, I can tell you that. Notice I dropped the seed in there. I'm gonna try to grab that up out of there real quick without burning myself. Hopefully I don't. I got it on low. You don't never want to cook lobster too fast. You just want to warm it up. If you cook it too fast, I can tell you your lobster gonna be hard. Move it around that butter, flip it around, do what you gotta do. Now I'm going to tell you, we're going to go ahead and the seed's still stuck on there, huh? We got that other pan on about two. We're going to drop us some butter in there. I don't want to put too much in there, huh? That might be a bad idea. 
anybody told you yet, butter kills. That way we can uh, heat up the rolls real quick. I'm gonna turn this up a little bit higher so it ain't doing much. But we only trying to heat it up anyway. You don't want to do a whole lot. Like I said, it's two containers, so that should get you enough for three out of each container. Move that around a little bit. Getting your whole video, huh? Now we're about ready to put the rolls in there. Actually turn it up a little bit so we can heat it real quick. These rolls feel like King's Hawaiian rolls. I can tell you that much. Some of the softest bread you can get. Now we're going to turn that down and leave it right there. Y'all have to forgive me, I got stuff all over the kitchen. Just to show you this brief experience. that one off because we're gonna let that one go gradually and cool crank that up a little bit you don't want it too much pull that off that's actually warm pull that one off that's warm throw that one on there for a second now we're gonna get some of that good old lobster and put it on this roll and see what happens we're gonna make it do what it do I will show you at the end. Anyway, this is your finished product. You got a main lobster roll. That's one right there. This is another one right there. So you can stop by, check it out. I'll let you know how it tastes and all that good stuff. There you go.